I'm Angel Maldonado. The title of serial entrepreneur has become over-glamorized in some circles, when in reality, building a company from the ground up takes grit, perseverance, and ability to believe when nobody else does, and there's nothing glamorous about that. With 25 years of entrepreneurial and business development experience, Kevin McGee knows exactly what I'm talking about. He's the founder and CEO of Avid Entrepreneurship, and he joins us now with more. Kevin, thanks for being here. Hey, thank you for having me, Angel. Good to be here. Well, I love what you're doing uh, in the startup space yes. and the way you're helping entrepreneurs really uh, get the tools and the know-how they need to build successful companies. Right. But before we talk about the company, talk about okay. where your passion comes from. Yeah, I think, you know, my passion comes from, like a lot of entrepreneurs, I've had a lot of failures, uh, more failures than successes, but it's those failures that really kind of help make you strong. And make Wait, you well, nobody person. talks about the failures. You're saying yeah. that entrepreneurs fail? Fa entrepreneurs fail all the time, all the time, Andrew, and I, and I think that's one of the things. That Three things that I could share with you that I think would help you be a better alumnus. They would be this. Know what you value. But better importantly, know who's valuable to you. You have many friends, colleagues, relationships. But how many of them are valuable to you? The second thing I would say is quickly discern and understand God's purpose for your life. Right. Our very own Benjamin May says that each man and woman was born into this world to do something unique, something distinctive, and that if he or she does not do it, it'll never be done. So what is it that you ought to do? What is your mark of I think about the four years that you've probably spent in college. Every year, the nation has heard about a young black man dying. Trayvon Martin, Jordan Davis, Michael Brown, Eric Hunter. So I can't help but think or even hope that some of your purposes are to go back and build communities, finance businesses, mentor young men who look just like you, mentor young men like Trayvon, Jordan, be everything that you can be and discern God's purpose for your life. And the last thing I would share with you is pretty easy, pretty quick. Once you understand what you value in life, and once you understand God's purpose for your life, don't waste your time pursuing anything else. You never know how much time you have. So having said.